set to race. They're ready. They're off. Racing over two miles and a half furlong for the Bet UK, home of the Acre Handicap Stakes. Just a little bit slow to go was Tradesman. They head up through the early stages. Champagne City, one of the first to begin in the pale blue and pink uh, Chevron towards the inside. Coldwell prominent in red and white quarters. And deep route Eagles Realm's got a good sit in black and beige. The Vegas Warriors just behind the pace in the orange and yellow half jacket with a white sash. They're followed by Bulldog Spirit Center Pack sitting in company with a ward dancer as they take the turn towards the home straight for the first time. Sitting well back in the field is the crafty master. Pianismo's behind that one, followed by Military Tycoon, and the slow-starting tradesman is at the back of the 10-runner field as they turn down the home straight for the first time. So levelling off towards us, still well over a circuit to travel, of course, Champagne City and Josie Gordon to the inside. Eagles Realm and Billy Lochnan towards the near side. They're followed through by Caldwell, who's riding behind the pace with De Vegas Warrior. Bulldog Spirit making up some ground towards the near side for Holly Doyle. Holly maybe not uh, totally happy with the pace. Centre field then at this stage is a ward dancer, followed through by the Crafty Master. Still well back, Pianissimo, followed through by Military Tycoon. And still at the back of the field is Tradesman and Haley Turn has got that one about 10 lengths off the leader, which continues to be Champagne City as they go past us with a circuit to travel. Champagne City by a length to Bulldog Spirit, followed through in third by Eagles Realm, and then Coldwell to the inside. They're followed through by De Vegas Warrior, who's next in the field, sitting towards the outside of a wood dancer. The Crafty Masters under a tight rein from William Carson towards the back, Pianissimo on his inside. They're followed by Military Kai Tycoon, no move from Machine Murphy on that one. And still at the back of the field is Tradesman and they continue to be 10 lengths off the leader, which is Champagne City as they level off into the back stretch. So inside the final mile, they're passing halfway. Champagne City still there, dictating a steady pace by three parts of a length. To Bulldog Spirit, who now sits handily in second position. Coldwell still tight down the inside fence. Races just behind the pace, followed through by Eagles Realm, who continues to steer a little bit wider. The Vegas Warrior is next in the field, followed by a ward dancer tight on the fence. Centre pack, just a little bit worse than centre pack. The crafty master is next in the field followed by Pianissimo. Still well back in the pack is Military Tycoon and so too Tradesmen. Pace just quickening a little bit as they race down inside the final five and a half furlongs. They're about to reach the end of the back stretch and start taking the turn and Champagne City still there by a half length to Bulldog Spirit racing second. Eagles Realm is right behind them with Caldwell on the inside fence. They're followed through by the Vegas Warrior and then on the inside a Wood Dancer. The Crafty Master is behind those. Left-handed they come through Three and a half furlongs to go. They're about to level up for the judge in the Bet UK, home of the Acker Handicap. Champagne City's made all so far. Still leads by a neck to Bulldog Spirit, racing second. Eagles Rem gets the hurry up behind them. Caldwell to the inside. The sprint is on now. They're followed by the Vegas Warrior, the Crafty Master, trying to pick up in the orange and purple extreme left. Down the straight, they come back inside the final two. Caldwell lays it down to Champagne City. Bulldog Spirit is kept going. The Crafty Master trying to power right over the top and is coming strong to the near side. The Crafty Master hits the front looking for a sixth consecutive win. Boots on by a couple of lengths to Coldwell. Kept going to Vegas Warrior and from the back bidding to Blush home is Tradesman. Inside the final half furlong the Crafty Master booted out. Will go on to land the spoils is one again. The Crafty Master goes in followed through by Tradesman in second. Coldwell was next. Tight behind the Vegas Warrior on the far side towards the near side Eagles Realm.